Hello, my name is Amy Goodman, and I'm the co-director of the Autism Now Center. This is the 16th video in our Autism Now Answers series. The question for this week is, what is Positive Behavior Support, or PBS? PBS is a process for understanding and resolving the problem behavior of individuals with disabilities. It is based on values and research. It offers an approach to development, to developing an understanding why the individual engages in certain behaviors and helps to create strategies for preventing the behavior and teaching new skills. There are six steps. Number one, building a behavior support team. The team is comprised of individuals who are most involved in the individual's life. It may include family members, teachers, friends, professionals, and the individual themselves. Two, person-centered planning provides a process for bringing the team together to discuss the vision and dreams for the individual. Usually this step involves using a map, making action plans approach, which includes drawing pictures of the who, what, when, and how the plan will be executed. Three, functional behavior assessment, or FBA is a process for determining the function of an individual's behavior. FBA involves the collection of data, observations, and information to develop a clear understanding of the relationship of events and circumstances that trigger the behavior. Four, hypothesis development. The FBA is completed by writing a behavior hypothesis statement. This statement summarizes what is known about triggers, behaviors, and consequences. It offers an informed guess about the reason for the behavior. Five, behavior support plan development. Essential components of the behavior support plan include prevention strategies, instructions for replacing the behavior with new skills, new ways to respond to the behavior, and what will happen when the behavior has changed or been extinguished. Six, monitoring outcomes. The effectiveness of the behavior support plan must be monitored. This monitoring includes any changes in the behavior. After introducing a replacement behavior, see if it is working or if it needs to be tweaked or refined in order for it to be effective in producing the desired outcome. This is a very brief overview of the process of positive behavior support, or PBS. For more detailed information, go to www.challengingbehavior.org. I hope this has been helpful. I hope this helps you with your journey into autism. And just remember, the more you know, the more empowered you will be.